I'm here today with Mark Nyquist, and Mark Nyquist is the community liaison for the Advanced Professional Home Health Care here in Grand Rapids. And Mark, Advanced Professional Home Health Care, they're a, a skilled nursing company. And so for the everyday person, what is skilled nursing? I like to think of skilled nursing very simply. When you go into the hospital and you see a nurse, that's the same nurse that's going to be coming into your home. Okay. I was looking at the website and you and I have had an opportunity to talk and there's a lot of different types of nursing situations that your company provides. What would be a few of those? It could be a um, more complex case as an uh, organ transplant patient coming out of U of M hospital or it could be as simple as a patient with a new diagnosis where our nurse can go in and educate them on that diagnosis. And so what if it's something maybe a little less complex, like maybe my mom comes out of the hospital but she's got some wound care issues, is that something that your nurses could help with? Yes, we can go, go into the home for wound care services. Okay. And I also noticed on the website that uh, you have nursing services that work with physical therapy, speech therapy, occupational therapy. Do they do that at someone's home? Yes, they do do that in the person's home or assisted living facility. Sometimes going in for rehab could be something as simple as a patient has had a fall and, and they're having uh, gait and stability issues. So they, we can come in and work with them. Or if they have a new assistive device, we can go in and work with that patient and train them to use that device. Okay. I also know that one of the things that um, Advanced Professional Home Health Care is known for is their psychiatric nurses that they are able to provide. Could you tell me a little bit more about those services? Yes, we have three wonderful psychiatric nurses. We work primarily with the uh, assisted living facilities, but we do also work with people in independent homes. Um, and you had mentioned to me when we were talking before that their approach is not necessarily just focused on, okay, what medications are these pe people taking or these patients taking, but more of a holistic per approach. When our nurse goes into the patient's home, they have to assess or they look at the full situation. What are some of the issues? What are some of the problems that they may be causing them to act out? So if we can look at the holistic approach first, trying to change or control certain things in their environment first, then go to medication second. Okay. And Mark, you have a very interesting position as community liaison for Advanced Professional Home Health Care and it really is um, an important role that you play. I was wondering if you could tell me a little bit about what you do there. It's actually kind of a fun and challenging job. I love to be able to coordinate between the doctor's office, the patient, the uh, assisted living facilities, the patient's family to make sure that patient is getting the best care they can get and as quick as they can. And part of your, uh, your position is not just sitting behind a desk. You do a lot of shuffling all day long. I can be in Southeast Grand Rapids one minute, Muskegon the next, Grand Haven. I'm shooting all over the three counties. And, you know, that's certainly something that's helpful, you know, if, if a patient has needs and maybe you're dealing with their family members, oftentimes I think that it would probably be hard to try and have to coordinate that on my own. Very difficult. And so that's a position that you kind of help jump through those hoops for people. Correct. And I think, you know, maybe that's something that helps set advanced professional home health care apart from other companies. If you were to describe what makes your company the company to choose, how would you say that? I want to say that we make the referral process very easy, very simple, because I will take care of what you need, needs to be done. And so as far as that, when, when you're getting a referral or when someone is going to need some skilled nursing care, some of the things that you've talked about, when they're coming out of the hospital, do people have the choice to choose the company that they would want to come in and work with them? Yes, they do have the choice and I highly suggest that people make their choices before they go into the hospital. Do your research. Find out who you want to work with when you get discharged. If, even if you end up 
even if you don't plan on going to the hospital, know who you want to work with. Educate yourself. And someone could call you, for example, and say, hey, you know, my mom's going in for a hip replacement next month and we're anticipating she might need some care. Could we have an interview with you? Sure, I'd be more than happy to meet with you, give you some of our company information, and talk to you about the process. So, Mark, if you have a patient who is in need of your services um, and they're going to need some skilled nursing, how are they going to uh, pay for that? Is that an insurance pay, private pay? Medicare will pay for 100%, but the patient has to be homebound. Homebound um, can be summed up as, as a very tasking effort for that patient to leave home. Okay, Mark with Advanced Professional Home Health Care, thanks for being with us today and sharing more about your company. All right.